In this video I'm going to show you how you can easily fix if videos on WhatsApp status are playing without sound. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes. As you can see guys, here I got a couple of videos in WhatsApp status from my contacts. I can tap at any status. As you can see, that is actually a video status and the sound currently is not playing, but I know for sure that uh, this status should be with sound. Now guys, I'm gonna show you how we can easily fix that issue. The first and the most common reason is to check if your iPhone is on silent mode, like in my case now. It shows that crossed out bell icon next to time, which means that the phone is on silent mode now and that's maybe the reason why sound is not playing. To turn off silent mode on an iPhone 15 we can just uh, hold down this action button here for a second until it says silent off or something like that. You can identify that by uh, that icon here. Now we don't see any bells next to time widget and it means that currently our device is not on silent mode. On iPhones 14 and earlier models right here located physical switch button so you can turn it back and forth in that way so that's how you can easily also turn off silent mode the next solution for you is to increase volume level on your device to do that just use this volume up button located at the same edge just uh, tap on it, just press on it, uh, you can press it volume up and volume down to, uh, to make sure it is not set to zero, just like that. Once you increased the volume level, you can check if it helps you or not by tapping right here. Another reason that may cause that kind of problem is that you need to update your WhatsApp app to the latest version. On an iPhone we need to head over to the App Store, on an Android we need to head over to the Play Store, then search for WhatsApp in that way, then tap at WhatsApp, and if this button says update, all you have to do is just tap on it, and then wait until the update is complete. Once the app is updated, hit open, head over to statuses and then check if it helps you or not. Another way to solve that issue is to clear WhatsApp cache. If all the above steps didn't help you, you need to head over to settings, then general and then iPhone storage. Here scroll down until you find WhatsApp and there we need to first of all tap at offload app and then offload app again here in this pop-up that will offload the app from your device and then you need to tap at reinstall app. What that will do, that will reinstall the app from the scratch and that may help you to remove any bugs, any errors that may cause that problem. So after the process is done, you will get the latest WhatsApp app version as in the previous step, but installed from the scratch. Once it shows you that offload app button again, it means that the app is reinstalled and then we need to open it up, head over to statuses and check if it helps us or not. And now guys, if all the above solutions didn't help you, I can recommend you the last way that may help you to solve that issue and the way is to restart your iPhone. To do that, we need to press at the same time volume up button and power button, just like that. 
press and hold until a dead screen appears and then all we have to do is just uh, drag the slider to the very right until uh, the screen turns off just drag it to the right then release your finger after that your iPhone will turn off then you need to wait about uh, 20 seconds and after that just long press uh, side button until Apple logo appears on the screen and then just wait until your device is loaded. There are all the ways that I found that may help you to solve that issue and if this video was helpful for you don't forget to hit the like button.